Hello everyone, welcome to the Study Hacks Institute of GIS and Remote Sensing. Hope all are you well. Today I will give you an announcement on new features on Google Earth Engine, JavaScript API Code Editor. So mainly now we are also write the Python code. All of this Python code we can easily learn run in the JavaScript API code editor okay and do for the all of those analysis in this code editor okay all of the chart all of those machine learning or deep learning or other types of remote sensing analysis we are easily do using the Python in the JavaScript API code editor so now mainly it's that uh, it's still experimental phase but now it's ready to the revolutionization about that um, GIS and remote sensing. So for that, uh, it also how we can easily get this type of feature on the Art Engine code editor. So for that, first of all, you have to just install this extension. You can see open Art Engine ex uh, extension. So mainly it is the Chrome. You can simply go to the Chrome web store. From that, you can simply install the open Art Engine extension simply uh, install this um, in your uh, this extension install in the in your browser so after that here you can say i can uh, get the sign open art things in extension then click on here and go to the option like you can see the option so click on the options so now i can get all of this option so mainly this extension helps you get the night mode okay so when i use this option i can i, I can easily uh, use the night mode in my code editor and get the code i can also you can see tab size also i can increase the font size and i also select my uh, font suppose you want to select uh, which font is better simply select the font as well as we can also get all of those shortcut keyword from here okay and also you can see in this time i want to write the code in the python you can see the python okay so i can simply first of all uh, it showing as a lock sign you can see you can get the feature look like that lock so here you can simply click on here it will be unlocked okay it means that it now unlock and when you use the google Earth engine javascript api code editor you can run uh, you can run the python code so mainly numpy matplotlib all of those other packages we can easily it mainly pre-install it okay so as well as we can easily use this type of package without install it okay so mainly now it is the experimental phase but further it also developed then we can easily uh, do lot of analysis using the python in the javascript code editor okay so after opening this lock i can simply click on here you can see simply click on here just click on here i can open this time it open the code editor and here we can get the message look like that you can see you have successfully activated the python for your code editor so now my code is ready to get the python write the python code so just i give the example so mainly this hash sign this symbol we are used for uh, write the comment in the write the comment in the mainly in the python okay so as well as i also write the some code suppose i simply put here that i give a variable name suppose result and i simply addition 100 uh, 10 plus suppose uh, 10 okay and also print that okay so then print that result okay so basically uh, we already know about that for the python uh, we did not use the var keyword but javascript we need to use at the var keyword so in this time i write the code in the python so i did not use the var keyword just i simply take a variable name and then uh, equal sign and put here the 10 plus 10 and now click to the run you can see what happened it's showing the weight that python is loaded okay in this time you can see it will be loaded it will be working okay so reboot automatically within the less than 10 seconds we can it will be activated for the python code okay so now you can say i can get the result from this python code it also activated the python you can see so now all of this python code now it's supported in my code editor so here i can give the another example suppose i want to create this type of chart so for that i simply copy the code from here and then paste in here okay so mainly in this time here you can say i use here the python package matplotlib okay this type of package now it's supported so click to the run 
here I can get the result. You can see it will be showing the chart look like that. We can get the chart look like that. Not only for that, all of those Python code, now we can easily uh, run in the JavaScript API code editor and get the analysis, all of those Python code. And now in the meantime, it also experimental phase, but it also develop day by day. And we can also do for the lot of things in the Python uh, using the Python programming language and do for the lot of things in the remote sensing in Google Earth Engine JavaScript API code editor. Okay, so hope uh, this news is also help you for you. So if you have any question or any doubt, you can simply contact with me and also try to use this uh, extension. You can see open Earth Engine extension and then also open the code editor for that Python. Okay. As well as in this code editor, we can also simply click on here, then we can easily get the night mode. Okay, we can easily get the night mode and also write our code. Okay, so thank you for watching that. And finally, I also give you an, an uh, announcement for my online training program. So our upcoming online training program will be start from the 8th September. So basically, it is the totally seven days online training program. In this online training program, uh, mainly held on the Friday and Saturday in a week total seven days is day we provide the three hours this is the time it will be start from the 9 pm to 12 am total three hours gmt plus six and training lang language is that english so if you want to join this online training program simply contact in this whatsapp number and also contact with this email so basically in this online training program we are mainly focused on the beginners who don't have any knowledge about the google earth engine platform or who don't have any knowledge about the javascript programming they can easily learn our online training program and get all of those things from the beginners to advanced level and then easily do for the lot of remote sensing analysis so mainly we cover all of those part land use land cover mapping and change detection air quality monitoring time series analysis calculating any indices supervised classification machine learning such as random forest classification industries support vector machine all of those unsupervised also showing that in this online training program here you can get all of this course content it will be cover all of this course content i will add all of those things in this video description just you can simply check it and if you want to join this online training program you can also get the some benefit you can get the course e certificate after submitting all of those assignment you can get the all of those materials such as pdf slide also get the practice code for all of the sport practice also provided and you can also get the recorded video class okay and you can get the lifetime teaching support when you face any problem you can get the supported okay so i add all of this information in this video description you can simply check it and if you want to join this up upcoming online training program just simply contact in this whatsapp number uh, or contact with this email then simply registration and then join our whatsapp group as well as also join our google classroom for joining our live training session okay so thank you for watching that. Stay safe, stay happy. Thank you.